So I just got a new iPhone and it has a charging pad. And while it was sitting there, I was started messing around with seeing how much stuff I could put between it and the charging pad, just wondering how thick a case could be. And I wondered, what happens if a floppy ends up in between there? Will it erase it? Well, let's find out. I've got two different kinds of floppies. I have the double density and the high density, and I have a computer with a double density drive and a high density drive. So the first thing to do is let's format a floppy and then put some test data onto it. The data I'm going to put on it is made up of a bunch of bit patterns of just alternating zeros and ones. And the entire file is just made up of that. So let's write that to the floppy. And then let's read it back in from the floppy and verify that it worked fine. And if this worked, it should just say that one file is shorter. Yep. Got an EOF on the test one. And I do have a control file, so I can compare it to that one. Oops. And you can see the files are identical. So let's take this out and put it on the charge pad. And my phone is not fully charged, so it will need to charge. And let that sit there for a little while. All right, so it's been about five minutes. Let's take it off the charging pad, put it back in the drive, and see if any of the data changed. No change at all, it didn't erase anything. All right, let's try the high density drive. All right, so let's format the high density disk. And then write the data to it, the test pattern. All right, with data written out, let's read it back in. Uh. 
And let's compare it and verify that it wrote and read back in just fine. And everything's fine. So let's take it out and see if the phone will erase it. All right, it's been another five minutes. So let's see if the high density disc had any bits flipped. And nothing flipped on that either. Actually, I'm a little bit surprised at that one. I thought the bits being smaller and weaker, since it's common that trying to write a 360K floppy from a high density drive won't read very well on one of these, I thought maybe it might actually erase something. But actually, I suppose it really isn't that surprising. So here it is charging, and I've got my great grandpa's compass here, and moving it around on here, it doesn't move at all. The, the magnetic field seems to be actually fairly weak. The only thing I've picked up is there seems to be magnets in the corner of the phone, which it picks up on. And I suppose if I swirl those magnets around, right on the floppy it might erase, but the magnetic field that's used to charge the phone is actually pretty weak. The results are definitely a little bit disappointing and it actually took quite a bit of work just to get that 360k floppy working under Linux. Uh, if you're curious about that and you want to see some other behind the scenes stuff, check out my Twitter and I put a link below in the description to the thread about getting that 360k floppy working. Thanks for watching.